Welcome back. Well, we had another fine day out there with some filtered sunshine this afternoon. Look for the clouds to quickly return as we head into the overnight hours. Current temperature now sits at 86. We've got our feel like temperatures in the upper 80s at one point this afternoon. They did sit in the lower 90s out there. And notice we've got a gentle breeze out of the east now at about 14 miles per hour, even shaking our camera a little bit. All right, so the next 12 hours, we're going to drop our temperatures into the upper 60s and lower 70s. A nice mild start for tomorrow. Temperatures quickly jump back into the upper 80s throughout the afternoon. But the difference here, we're going to see some cloud cover. We're also going to look for the possibility of a few showers. So, headline wise, we're going to look for a few spotty storms on Saturday heading into Sunday. It looks like early on, maybe even throughout the day, we're going to look for scattered to numerous showers and thunderstorms and possibly one or two storms on the strong side. We're talking a marginal risk going into Saturday, but that's mainly for northern portions of the viewing area. We're talking southern Mississippi. Mississippi. And then as soon as all that passes, we fall into a very summer like pattern for next week. The heat returns. Highs in the lower 90s feel like temperatures will sit in the mid 90s as that humidity starts to creep back. Satellite and radar picture pretty quiet across the board as you watch your future cast heading into the morning hours of tomorrow. We'll start out with a few clouds heading into late morning, early afternoon. Look for the possibility of an isolated shower to develop. Again, all of that mainly because of that southerly wind, that onshore flow. So, a few possible storms kind of developing ahead of that main line. But moving in to about midday on Sunday, and as you notice, there are a couple heavier pockets. The majority of that rainfall should be sitting north of that I 10, I 12 corridor. So the stronger storms, we're talking Amy, Pike, and Wilkinson counties. And as you see here, moving back into Monday, maybe a lingering shower, otherwise, a drier pattern heading into the next week. So as you notice, for tomorrow, we'll see a couple thunderstorms. The green right here is a marginal risk for severe weather, and that's one out of five, a few spotty storms heading into your Saturday. Same scenario. You notice moving into Sunday, it shifts a little bit further north, east into southern Mississippi, that marginal risk. Once again, a few spotty storms out there, and it looks like that's going to be early on Sunday. So here's that chance for rain. Look for a couple storms tomorrow, a little better chance for some showers and thunderstorms heading into your Sunday, and then a drier pattern heading into next week. But then it gets hot. Your Amy River, we're also keeping an eye on the river stages, and everything is now below flood stage for from Bayou Manchek all the way down to French Settlement. We're also keeping a very close eye on the tropics. They've got another area they're watching out there. Chance of development still pretty low at about 30%, but it's something to kind of keep an eye on as we make our way into the weekend. Here is that seven day picture. And as you notice, we'll start out with the first three going into the weekend. We've got 87 with a few scattered showers, storms on. Sunday, stay weather aware. Moving into Monday, the possibility of a lingering shower. Otherwise, highs will sit in the 90s, feel like temperatures mid 90s, and those overnight lows will sit in the lower 70s. And your skeeter meter brought to you by Selvin. It looks like we're currently going high across the board. We'll be right back.